Hey you, welcome to Casa Landego. Tonight, I am doing my nighttime routine with my newborn. I'm a mom of four. I've got a seven-year-old, a five-year-old, a two-year-old, and a new-year-old. I'm gonna be honest, every night kind of looks a little bit different, but we'll take you along for the ride of tonight. Early, it's like not quite six o'clock. We're getting bath times done today. Why are you all blue? Yeah, so he legit spray painted himself. His brothers were spray painting rocks with a couple cans of spray paint and he got his hands on them. Whoa! Oh my goodness! Tell everybody, why are you all blue? Because they all right, we're all finished. This guy's all nice and clean. You got your diaper on. Mama's got to get ready for bed. So I use cloth pads and cloth nursing covers. But at nighttime, I use disposables because it just makes life so much more easier. So we're going to grab a couple of those. This one? Yep. This one. <laughs> Oh dear baby bear, we're coming. All right, this little guy's already fussy, so we're just gonna go ahead and give him a feed. One of the downsides of having so many kids is sometimes you can't just sit down and breastfeed. You kind of gotta cower through feeding while attempting to get the toddler ready for bed. Otherwise, we're gonna be all up till midnight, let's be honest. Okay, Quinny, let's put your pants on, come on. <laughs> down? Yes. Pull it up. Put your foot down. Alright. Push, 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 push. Pull your jammies up. Shake your butt in there. <laughs> Get your butt in there. Good job. <laughs> Literally, this could probably be the entire video. Boobies, boobies, and an extra side of boobies. If you have lots of kids and you gotta get out of the door early in the morning, sometimes I just dress my kids in what they're gonna wear in the morning. I'm I found mine! Woo! <laughs> okay. Alright, your shirt's on inside out. Wait. Okay. Alright, you guys to get your jams on? Show me your jimmy jams. Perfect. Do you wanna say hi everybody? Okay, so the number one thing I'm going to mention is Vince is exclusively breastfed, so no formula. Before I start my nighttime routine, I like to make sure that I have my nightside table prepped with everything that I'm going to use at night. And so I make sure that I have burp cloth, diapers. I have his vitamin D drops beside the bed because I always give him his vitamin D drop during the night. And then I always make sure that I fill up a nice big glass of water beside my bed because, oh my goodness, breastfeeding makes you thirsty. I gotta get my jammies on! Yikes. For nighttime, I wear these like, they're like nursing tanks. I got the little click snaps for easy access. I also co-sleep and the reason why I co-sleep is, well it started with my first son, I had a c-section and I literally couldn't get out of bed to go get him and so it was just easier to have him sleeping with me. After I did that with my first one, I just always co-slept all my other kids and it works for us. It might not work for everyone. Well, sometimes these nights happen and it looks like tonight's our lucky night. We're gonna have a fussy bum because he is just not settling or letting me put him down. <laughs> Nighttime routine with a fussy baby that doesn't want to be put down. Make sure you got a fresh nappy, huh, baby? And I always put down a receiving blanket on that side of the bed because if his diaper leaks or if he spits up, then I don't have to rip all of the sheets out. I just pick up that blanket. And <laughs> you hold them like this, where you've got their head, your head between and then your hand on their chest. And then I just put them over my knee and I kind of pat. 
burps like a champ when I'm this method where you see. I'm gonna give him his vitamin D drops. Uh -oh. Ladies and gentlemen, that is why we have this on the bed. Because stuff like that happens all the time and you don't want to be changing the shoe. Hiccups are the worst, hey dude. Aww. Oh, I'm really tired. I, I wish he didn't have the hiccups and I wish we could go to sleep. I'm just gonna lay him down and pray he falls asleep. Man. Because he only nursed on one side, I'm gonna pump the other side. I got uh, one booby that's like the super producer, and the other booby that's kind of the slacker booby. And the slacker booby is more than enough for him. Sorry. in the morning and this guy is still awake. We made it kind of. It's the next day. Super tired. But to the night. So thanks for joining us on my nighttime routine with my <laughs> newborn and my other little guys. Don't forget to give a like and subscribe. And as always, say thanks for watching.